Again, another one of uh, Chelsea's summer signings that's making the impact. Ben Chilwa, how impressed have you been, Mario, with how what he's doing with this side this season? Uh, actually, you know, like when I became a, like actually a TV producer in America, um, my focus was on finding young talents. And I went to a tournament when I saw Chilwa the first time. He was playing for Young England. And that time he was still at Leicester. But what I really liked about Chilwa was the way he attacked uh, the game. He has a skill that his timing is incredible. It's it's so good that sometimes you look at him and you feel like he he doesn't dribble or, or does be the player like sometimes you see very skillful uh, outside players, especially because a uh, defender when you see him beating a player, he has great timing of getting into situations and arriving and being dangerous straight away. So for him to score a goal like that, it's just going to add up more to his game because when I came in France and I saw him playing at Toulon when in young England won the, the um, actually uh, the tournament he was playing left back as well for the young England side and just the way he was playing I asked at that time I didn't know I wasn't as familiar with Chilwell and I asked someone about that player I said who is that and they explained to me who it was my eyes were on him so much that after that I kept on following him at Leicester so when Chelsea came after him it was only normal so that's why what I see today it's just the chill world that I know. A guy that arrives in the situation late and has a great timing of what time do I need to get there and he can. And then the left delivery of him as a crossway, that's also very good. Now, Frank Lampard was asked there about uh, his hopes, of course. They are sitting in third right now. And it, it is a big win for Chelsea in the sense that Man City and Liverpool are playing tomorrow. So either one or maybe both sides as well may just drop points. I mean, what, what's their title hopes looking like for you, Gary? Chelsea, good chance? Well, they're, they're certainly looking a real threat. Um, but, you know, Frank Lampard just said that he's been in football a long time and he knows how, how quickly it can change. Early part of the season, lots of question marks about uh, Chelsea. Not that we're a long way into the season now. Um, but things looking much, much better, defensively more solid, scoring goals going forward. Um, but if you look at the league table at the moment, between eighth and top of the table, the separation is a total of three points. Some of those sides yeah. have played eight games. Some of them have played seven. You know, that's how tight it is. So, you know, off the back of what happens on the Sunday games in England... Um, you know, Chelsea's league position will almost certainly look very different come the end of play on Sunday than where it is at the moment where they sit third. But no, I, I think Frank Lampard must be quite quietly pleased with how it's gone so far. Mario, hopeful for Chelsea yeah. for the title? Yeah, no, look, I think it's too early to call about the, the title, but is Chelsea up there? Yeah, of course, and they should be, because, I mean, look, don't get me wrong, they are a team that has spent the most in the Premier League coming and moving forward, so we expect them to be around the top uh, three, definitely. I also said that, you know, like before, and I said they have to be up there amongst themselves. Liverpool is the team to beat because they won the league before, but also one of the best teams in the Premier League. I know Southampton is at, at the leading point right now, but still, you got to look at... at uh, the Chelsea side and expect them to be up there but we all know when December and January comes and you come out well that's when you can consider yourself because if we look back at the years when I was playing in the Premier League if I look back and I highlight for example Man United they were a team that always did well in December and in January and that made them win the league so going back to that Chelsea have won it a number of times but they definitely have to make sure that in those crucial months when it gets really, really, really crucial. You have to make sure you push forward and win things.